How to make sweet and sour chicken. Hi, my name is Chef Jessica, and today we're going to be making sweet and sour chicken. Sweet and sour chicken is a dish that you commonly find in Chinese restaurants, and it has a Cantonese background. The ingredients that you find inside are ingredients that you can find in your own home. Here's the list of ingredients you will need. Step one, prepare the chicken. The first ingredient is chicken breast. You wanna cut your chicken breast into about one inch cubes. Place your chicken in a clean bowl and add half a cup of cornstarch. The cornstarch will act as a sealing agent when you fry your chicken. It's important to fry your chicken in hot oil before you stir fry it because it seals in the moisture allowing you to have nice tender pieces of chicken in your dish. Step two, oil blanch the chicken. We are now going to oil blanch our chicken. Oil blanching requires high heat to seal in the moisture of the chicken. Try not to overcrowd the pan as the chicken might stick to each other. For a pound of chicken, I would split it in half for deep frying. You're only partially cooking the chicken. You will not completely cook the chicken. This will probably take about 30 seconds to a minute. And drain on paper towels. And repeat with the remaining chicken. Step three, prepare the vegetables. Now we're gonna take a green pepper you then want to cut your green pepper into about one inch cubes, similar to the size of the chicken. Also remove some of the ribs, the white part of the green pepper, as they tend to be bitter. You then also want to dice your pineapple into similar sizes. You're also going to want one small to medium sized onion. You're going to try to cut your onion into one inch cubes. And now let's add the ingredients to our wok. Step four, stir fry. First, it's important to heat your wok up. Once you see smoke starting to come out, you can then add your oil. One tablespoon of oil around the side of the pot. You'll start by adding your onion and green bell pepper. Then add your pineapple. Now you can add your sauce ingredients. You can start with your vinegar, your sugar, your ketchup, and your sesame oil. Stir that around for at least one minute and then add your chicken. Let this mixture rest for a couple of minutes so that the chicken can fully cook through. Step five, thicken the sauce. For the last part of this dish, we will be thickening the sauce. Our water and our cornstarch, we're now gonna to mix together to create our slurry. Mix it around with your finger and slowly add it to your pot. Make sure to keep stirring as you don't want the slurry to be clumpy. To serve sweet and sour chicken, you can serve it with rice along with other dishes. This will serve four people with rice or serve two on its own. Your sweet and sour chicken is now done. Enjoy.